right, Benson. Where is it? Down the hall and to the left. <laughs> Come on, Benson. Don't fool around with me. I wouldn't dream of it. <laughs> there are my groceries. Well, you're in the kitchen. You must be getting warm. Benson, I just called the grocer, and he said the delivery boy left my order on the back porch two hours ago, and I can't find it. Krause, if you're trying to cover up for those dogs, forget it. You think the dogs ate the groceries? And the delivery boy. $22 worth of groceries can't just disappear. $22 worth of groceries can slip through a crack in the porch. Well, just between you and me, Something is very strange here. I got an idea who it is. <laughs> Hi, Katie. Nothing. That was my next question. Well, I'll see you later, Benson. Yeah, you think you'll make it back by spring? <laughs> what do you mean? You look like a squirrel hoarding up for the winter. Oh, this. Yeah, that. Oh, this is just a little snack. What are you going to do with all that stuff? You promise not to tell anybody else? Maybe. I have a tapeworm. Really? Well, I'll talk to you later, Ben. So I've got to be running along. You eat all that stuff and you'll be rolling along. Did you have enough? Well, it's good. What was it? Those white things were marshmallows, and those yellow things were potato chips, and the rest was just junk food. <laughs> Who is it? Reverend Ike, it's time to pray. <laughs> Check the minute. Come on, Katie, where is he? Where is who? Come on, Katie, we got a real problem here, and I need to know. What makes you think he's here? I followed the trail of M&Ms. <laughs> it is all right, Katie. I do not want to make trouble. But you haven't made any trouble. You want to bet? The Russians are claiming we kidnapped him. But we didn't. Yeah, I know that, and you know that. And even if the Russians know that, they're not going to admit they know that. Then I will tell them the truth. Unfortunately, son, they're not interested in the truth. They're looking to make a big McGill out of this, and so far they've done a pretty good job. You disappear, they say you, we've got you, and here you are. I must go back to Comrade Petrov. But if you do that, he'll just make you keep on with the tour. What else can I do? Benson, you have to help him. You just have to. Please, sir. I do dumb things to run away. It's only because I miss too much my mother and father. Will you help me, please? Well, son, it's not that easy. I don't know what I can do. I only want to go home. I have nobody else to help me. Please. <laughs>